Alrighty, so yet again, no um, tripod for now, so it's herky-jerky land. And I'll start off with the books that I didn't, uh, one book that I did not get from the thrift store today. This was, uh, I picked, it's a uh, well, little brats. Um, got this from Awesome Books, they're uh, a UK company. However, um, I ordered a bunch, of, well not a bunch, but I think about three or four, three. And um, yeah, the other ones didn't show up. I was like, hey, what the hell? But uh, I'm not, you know, I mean, at least one, <laughs> one's better than none. The other two are coming. <clears throat> Excuse me. And these things too, they were just like three bucks for the pack of, deck, uh, pack of cards. It's just old Delta Airlines. This one hasn't even been open, for goodness sakes. Um, these are nice. Just those ye old ones. They're going to remind me of like, you know, my grandparents' time. It's even got that smell. These, this is, um, I thought they were cards, but they're, they called them book, uh, Book plates are decorative gummed labels with a space for your name. I don't know what the hell. I've never heard of this before. Show that you value your books by protecting them with book plates. Are you out of your fucking tree? Oops, sorry. Uh, select a design with care, then put one on the inside front cover of each volume you own. No. Um, anyway, so I'll figure out something to do with them. So, the, anyways, yeah, this is a huge stack. It was an interesting walk home. I could tell you that much. But, uh, so this one, yeah, what a haul and a half. So this one I think I already have, I'm pretty darn sure Zoe, um, took, uh, borrowed it. So I was like, hey, wait a minute, it's in amazing shape. So I was like, okay. <laughs> Unless Zoe's trying to make money, but no, it's all donations. <laughs> this book is actually not for me. It's about, it's a bunch of, uh, crows and ravens or something. I, uh, I have a colleague friend of mine that is really, really into birds, like you have no effing clue. And um, so I thought uh, she would like this for sure. And uh, so away it goes. I also saw a uh, crow RPG thing, and I'm going to be picking that up for her for it. Uh, it was basically nothing. So, uh, oh, should I strip pop on over here? Hold on. Like I said, I, it's going to be a bit herky jerky, but I'll try to be nice. These are in amazing shape. It's just it's shocking. So the Red Baron, trying to be uh, non-glary here. I'll try to do this and see if that works. So this ought to be like as if, like when I saw this, it's like, well, someone better tack on another hundred years to my life because I mean, there's no way. <laughs> oh, well, we'll see what goes. Uh, this looks darn interesting. Holy moly, I can't wait for this. That's going to be fun. To just to take a look, so uh, especially when it says Grand Strategic Grand Strategy Series. Ooh, all right, I like the sound of that. Um, and this is the Imperial War Museum. Oh my gosh, this is so neat. Um, I've used a ton of their images um, um, for the poster of the day stuff. So this is going to be awesome. Uh, this book, uh, this book as well, is not for me. This is a gift. It's going off to somebody, and that's the way it goes. And this, uh, these are just in amazing shape. And this one's about the psalm. It looks, uh, what is it? The Collected collected Letters of Lewis Windermere Knot. Um, okay. Well, we'll find out, man. I'm going to find out. I've heard of this. I've heard, or I've seen, I think I've heard of the title. Maybe I'm wrong. Cataclysm, the First World War as Political Tragedy. Um, I'm not sure, but it sounds pr uh, pretty good. This one's in amazing shape as well. Sapper Martin, I've heard of this one as well. The Secret Great War Diary of Jack Martin. Um, I think I have it on my on my wish list, but no longer. I don't need to do that. Uh, no, these are just jaw droppingly in great shape. Uh, no Man's Land, 1918, Last War of the Great. Oh gosh, Almighty, eh? And um, uh, Bing, um, General Bing. So here we go. Boink. It's going to be interesting. Oh my god. I, lo I was like, please, please don't just be about rail uh, rail things or whatever. Uh, like, or rail guns or whatever these things are called. Please, for the love of God, be about, um, like, r like how important railroads were in World War I. And, yep, there's a big chunk of it there. So I was like, okay, goody. That's great. Um, this, uh, Margaret, Margaret McMillan, it... Gosh, these things are heavy. Uh, the war that ended peace. Um, this ought to be interesting. Well, they're all going to be interesting. Goodness gracious. And this one here. History of the Great War. Look at that picture. Jeez, man. It's uh, it's pretty bloody obvious. That's staged. <laughs> or the last thing a German photographer saw. 
Anyways, the Shadow of uh, Vimy Ridge, that's going to be another nice one. And look at this. This is the first one I saw, I think. And I lo No, it was the poetry book. And um, look at this. Just amazing shape. Let's just take a quickie looky at this one here. I'm sure some of these things are going to be popped into the po- I don't know though, I don't- Oh yeah, I can. Well, <laughs> some the pictures, they're there. Ooh, oh my god. Look at this. This is going to be, ooh, jeepers jumping, eh? John Warwick Brook, Dreadnoughts of the Battlefield, Third Battle of Ypres, 26 September 1917. Whoa, look at that thing. Camo on the, t on the tank. Anyways, that's it. I hope you're having a freaking awesome time. Um, I'm about to, uh, I was going to do some other shopping bits, but I'm, I'm glad I went here first. I was like, okay, well, you better go home and um, drop off and... Uh, go back out again. I have to go and see if I can find some uh, clear plastic um, uh, clear plastic th panes or something like acrylic panes or something at the dollar store so I can make a clear uh, uh, thing for my um, I guess still gonna call it old Newton until I can figure out something better. Um, yeah my old Newton game which I've just been having an absolute blast but like I said I just uh, can't wait to play with somebody else. Yep alright that's it. See ya. Hope you're having a good time.